Hi guys, welcome back to another video of the Northern Blankers. We're joined here today with Paul, he's on our session, like I said on the last vlog. Uh, we're here for 24 hours on the famous Lim Vale in Cheshire, one of our club waters, part of the Lim Angling Club. Um, we got here this morning, just set up and whatnot now at a brew. Uh, it's fishing very slow. Um, I don't, I've seen a few things for the waters down south, they seem to be waking up, but a lot of the waters up in the northwest still very quiet. Um, not seen nothing or heard anything today same as last week on the hard lake we was on we had nothing on that session so all quiet so far so yeah so we're on this session today obviously we'll try and get a fish for you we've got Paul he's just come in there's Paul hi and um, we're doing some cooking videos later mainly Paul does the cooking I just watch Blank. Yeah, we're both blank, hence the channel, Northern Blankers. So yeah, uh, we'll give you an update in the next couple of hours, or if anything comes sooner, we shall uh, give you an update. Alright guys, just give you a bit of a tour of the the peg, we're on a double peg. Paul's baby there, Paul's going to just do some, just going to flip the deeper out, see what's going on. My baby there, Got Paul's rods. I'll have three rods on here during the winter winter months. He's got my rods there. Paul's only got two out, he's gonna put his third out shortly once he makes his mind up. And there's a, a view of the lake. It's not a big lake. So and there. Goes round. And then ends there. It's a lovely mature lake. Some pretty big fish in here as well. I think there's catfish up to nearly 100 pound. And we have a um, map go to about 30, maybe mid 30s. I'm not, not too sure to be honest on the stocker out. But there's some good fish to go at. So yeah, it's starting to rain again. One minute it's sunny, one minute it's raining. Welcome to the north people, or the northwest I should say. So uh, yeah, no fish as of yet. We'll give you an update later on. Cheers guys. I'll just give you a bit of a video on one of the rigs we're using today. Got a bit of a leadless core leader down to a lead clip, lead clip system. A, I think that's a four ounce lead on the old Bowden rig, which I told you about last week. I don't think I've shown you on the video. Fluorocarbon down to a wafter onto a little mesh bag of boilies. So that is one of the go to rigs. Got a pop-up on one of the other rigs. Um, on my left hand rod, middle rod here, got a fluorocarbon D rig on the spot. Fishing 11 wraps out to them two trees there. Nice two white trees as a marker. So they're the tactics, just coming into evening now. Yeah, not a lot's happened today guys, so not much footage to go along with. I've seen them carp in the snags before. Still got a rod on the on the snags, but it's done absolutely nothing. Very very quiet up here in the northwest. Um, just getting a brew on now. Paul's doing a brew, and we're going to start tea. So we'll do our first cooking video before it gets dark. We're on sausage mash, black pudding, onion gravy, and carrots. So yeah, for tea today. So yeah, I'll give you an update if we get one through the night. Next video will be our cooking video. So, I'll give you an update when one comes, guys. Cheers. Alright, guys, here we are. Paul's time to shine. <laughs> cooking with Paul. What's on today's menu, Paul? Sausage, mash, and onion gravy. Sausage, mash, and onion gravy. And black pudding. And black pudding. So we've see we've got our sausages there, we've got some carrots that Paul has part boiled at home and chopped at home so it's easier to prep on the bank. 
we have got onion, onion which has been chopped and prepped at home again which makes it easy for yourself guys if you do all this at home unless if you want to do it on the bank this is all being cooked on the Ridge Monkey stove and the Ridge Monkey pans we're not sponsored or anything by Ridge Monkey but we do rate them very good set of pans as you can see What else have we got, Paul? We've got some some mash there, just pre-made mash from Asda. All you do is whack that in the pan, heat it up, smooth, smooth and buffy. Bit of gravy, pepper, and some berry black pudding. Now, you guys in the south probably don't know much about berry black pudding, but it's probably one of the best pudding, black pudding you'll get probably in the country. Oh yeah. So as you can see, Paul's just gonna cook these sausages low and slow. Cook the veg in low and slow. And it'll turn there. Oh yeah. And we'll come back to you in a couple of minutes when we get a bit more further on. All right guys, so sausages have been cooked. The gravy's been cooked. We just put the sausages into the gravy pan. Put in a bit of butter in the pan here now for the old mash. The carrots have been heated up and it's been put into the pot. They will get thrown in shortly. There you have it there guys, sausage mash, black pudding, carrots and onion gravy. Bon appetit. That was cooking with Paul. Enjoy. Good morning guys. Safe to say it was another quiet night. Very quiet for me and Paul. Not a, no beeps. Um, well, all the beeps we had was the coot this morning. Oh my god. There's my kettle. Let's get a brew on. Pour that. There we go. Yeah, like I said, it's a quiet night. Quite cold still. We've seen one fish show this morning, which is a lot more than what we seen yesterday out in the, out in the lake. So other than that one show and the fish in the snags I'm still very quiet just brought my left hand rod in now it's been out since yesterday afternoon got a lead clip system on that with a Ronnie rig I'm going to change that to a white pop up that's been out like I said since yesterday just absolutely now so uh, yeah just got a brew on the go the lake's looking beautiful this morning Turn that round there, look at that. Lovely morning today. Not cloudy like it was yesterday. Lovely. I could just do with a fish to be honest. Get our first fish of 2023 will be nice, either for me or Paul. So yeah, we'll change this pop up over. Get it out in the pond. Yeah. Yep. Right, so we decided executive decision we're putting it back down the snags because there's probably a good chance them fish yesterday will probably be there so we've got a little ronnie there with a white pop up this time instead of a pink a little mesh bag of goodness corn maggot and a bit of live system so we're going to win that 
down there now. Let's hope that goes on. Come on, let's get out. Right guys, as you can see, there won't be any more updates on today's session. It's been very quiet here on Lim Vale. So we're just doing a slow pack up. Got the barrows up there. That's a bit of a bit of a hill to push up. So yeah. No fish as of yet for the channel and no fish for this year. So when we're gonna be next out on our fishing adventures with the Northern Blankers, hopefully try and get at least a session in a month, hopefully. Depending on work and family commitments and stuff. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll give you an update when we're next back on. Like and subscribe. Thank you very much. Come on the cab. <laughs>